Welcome to my YouTube channel. Our today's lesson is about finding square root of numbers using long division method. Welcome. If you are given a number like this to get the square root, as you can see the number is a bit big for you to use prime factorization. And therefore, that's why we use long division method, which is quite easy if you keep on practicing. So let's start. The first step, you need to pair the digits. Starting from the right hand side towards the left. Pairing means you put them in groups of two. And therefore here, the first two digits, we pair them like that. And the last two digits, we pair them like that. After that, now you put the long division sign. And then now you come to the left hand side whereby we have the first pair. And our first pair is 23. Now, you look at a perfect square that is near 23. So, as you know, 1 squared is equals to 1, 2 squared is equals to 4, 3 squared is equals to 9, 4 squared is 16, 5 squared is 25. Therefore, a perfect square that is near 23 is 16. So I put 16 there, and which number had we squared? We had squared 4. So 4 we put it here, which now becomes our quotient. And therefore, 4 times 4 gives us 16. The next step, we take away. 23 take away 16. So we borrow one here, it becomes 13. 13 take away 6, it's 7. As you can see, on our right hand side, we take away, but on our left hand side, we add. What are we adding? Now we come here, we add the quotient. So it was four, our quotient is four, we also add four. And here, we put eight, because four plus four is eight. And then make sure you leave a gap here. So you put a box here, and also a box up here. And therefore, after you, after you put the box, and therefore, now you drop the other pair. Make sure you don't drop a single digit. You drop a pair. That's why we started by pairing them. So we drop here as a pair, and our pair is 0, 4. And our new number is 704. After reaching there, we look at a digit that when we put it here, and the same digit we put it here, when we multiply, it gives us 704. A hint is that the last digit here tries to help us to know which digit are we going to put here and also put it here. Now we look for a number when we square it, it ends with a 4. One of the numbers is 2. 2 squared is a 4. Another number is 8. Because 8 squared, it gives us 64. It ends with a 4. So we can try to put 2 and see. So if here we put 2 and here we put 2, now 82 times this 2, this will be 4, and this shall be 16. So as you can see, these are very small number as compared to 704. So here, we normally use trial and error method. So let's try the other number. When we square it, it gives us a digit that ends with 4. So let's try 8. So now we remove 2, we put 8. And also here, we put 8. So our new number will be 88 times 8, so 8 times 8 is 64, so 4 carry 6, 8 times 8 is 64, plus 6 is 70. And therefore, here it's 704 because of digit 8 here and digit 8 here. Remember inside you normally take away, 4 take away 4, 0, 0, 0, but inside we normally add. What we add? We, add, we normally add the quotient, and our quotient here is 8, so we put 8 here. 8 plus 8, 16, carry 1, 9. And therefore, as you can see here, we have 0, 0. And the square root of 2,304 is equal to 48. See you next video. We are going to do square root of a bigger number and a more complex one using long division. Bye-bye.